All right, now that you have your cable tension, your limit screws, your chain, and your shifters all checked, we're going to want to fine tune the shifting on your derailleur. As I mentioned, the derailleur works by the cable releasing or pulling tension. So, if you've got a really tight cable, it's going to shift up really well, too tight, and it's not going to shift back down. As a general rule of thumb, I like to tell people that if they want it to shift up the cassette better, turn the barrel adjuster in the direction that you want it to shift. So turning it this way, which loosens the barrel adjuster, will help it shift this way. Shifting it this way towards the outside of the bike will help the chain shift down. So you'll want to just do a small quarter to half turns and find that sweet spot where the chain shifts up the cassette and down the cassette equally well. Again, when you have your shifting set correctly, the chain should move up one gear at a time, be quiet in each gear without any skipping, and not shift off into the spokes or off into the frame. So if we want it, let's do a quick check here. Shift into the smallest cog, and we'll start just going up one gear at a time. And in each gear, check to make sure that you don't have any noise. And then you can actually push on the shifter very hard to see if it shifts into the spokes. Same thing on the way back down. Check each gear. And it looks like we've got our derailleur set up correctly with proper cable tension and proper limit screws. Now, sometimes it'll shift really well on the bike stand, but you go out to ride your bike and it doesn't behave the same way. So always go out and ride your bicycle after to check and make sure that you did all your steps correctly and that your bicycle is going to shift correctly both in the bike stand and in the natural environment when you're riding up or down a hill. And you can always use this barrel adjuster on the fly when you're out riding your bike to adjust to, according to your needs. And it's a great way to be able to do some bike mechanics on the fly.